What is up guys? I'm back with another Amazon video. This time I wanted to show y'all exactly what I do as an Amazon warehouse worker. So I'm gonna bring y'all inside with me and show you guys exactly what I do every night. It's 5.50 right now, my shift starts at six. The weather is great, I have a lot of energy. So I'ma head inside and let's go get this started. guys i just made it back to my car um on my first break it's 8 31 i clocked out at 8 26 so at 8 56 i need to be back inside the building and clock back in but this is usually what i just do i come into my car um let me show you guys. i eat some food i got some chips some peanuts um some bread and iced water so yeah, this is basically what I do. Um, I usually just like listen to music or uh, talk with friends on my phone and yeah, just stuff like that to pass the time. This is actually an extra shift I decided to pick up a couple days ago. So this is actually the fourth day in a row that I'm working. Usually I'd only be working three times a week, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, all for 12 hours for a total of 36 hours. But the shift I'm taking right now, it's 10 hours. So a little bit shorter than my usual shifts. And because of that, I don't get the third 15 minute break, which I talked about in my last video. So yeah, I'm I'm just gonna chill in here for the next 15 to 20 minutes and then head back inside into the warehouse and then get back to work. So I'll see you guys then.
the station and yeah, about to break. Here we go. What is up guys? It's half past midnight. I'm on my second break now. I'm really tired of just storing. My feet are kind of hurting um, because I've been standing for the past three hours, but yeah, happy to be on this break right now. So you guys probably saw in the papers that I showed, that was the list of all of the people who are stowing with me in the warehouse at the same time. And it's listed in order of efficiency. So for me, I was like number 22 or 23. And there was a total of maybe 150 or so uh, people on the list. So that's 150 people stowing in the building right now. And I was like 22. I'm usually around that, that number. They give it to you every single night in like the middle of your shift. And the highest I've ever seen myself is probably number seven out of 150 or so. So yeah, I'm usually like the top. But yeah, it is what it is. I'm just gonna chill in here for the next 15 to 20 minutes and then head back in for the final three and a half hours of work. And then I'm done for the night and I get to go home. go away. I'm gonna walk up to the station, say goodbye to the carts, and yep, now we're done. Finally done working at Amazon. If I could show you all that logo in the background. Yeah, you can probably tell, but yeah, walking back to my car now. Really exhausting day. This is my fourth day in a row. Um, looking forward to going home and just relaxing and just doing nothing but rest my legs up. What is up guys? I just got back home. It's a quarter past five in the morning and I actually left my house exactly 12 hours ago. So even though my shift was on paper 10 and a half hours, it really took 12 hours. But yeah, that's basically all I do every day I work at Amazon. As you guys can see, there's a lot of walking. The warehouse is really big and there's a lot of stowing items into shelves. These two things make up the majority of what you're gonna be doing at an Amazon warehouse, regardless of where you're working in the country. So yeah, that's really all there is to it. And if this was a Friday or a Saturday, I'd be getting ready to do it all again tomorrow. And like now and every other day I work, my legs are always really, really tired. So if you're planning on working here or at an Amazon fulfillment center, be ready for that. But yeah, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed my day in the life type of video for working at an Amazon fulfillment center. And yeah, I hope this video can be useful to those of you who are gonna be working at an Amazon fulfillment center soon, or maybe are thinking about applying for one of these jobs uh, in the near future. So yeah, if you guys like the video, please hit like for my legs. They need a lot of support right now. And be sure to be on the lookout for my upcoming Amazon videos. I think they're gonna be particularly useful to those of you who are gonna be working at Amazon soon or are thinking about working at Amazon. 
And as always, if you have any questions, concerns, or anything else, please leave it in the comments below. I'll definitely do my best to answer all the responses that we get. But other than that, stay safe, guys. I'll see you all soon.